and always beside the line and that is male equality. In the world of feminism, in this era of feminism, it is damn okay and, is ve and it is very important to give rights to women. At least they should know their value and at least they should know their worth. But can we just take a moment and talk about how a man dies each day, each and every day? Wait, what? A man dies each day? Are you serious? You guys you thinking like that or am I exaggerating my thing? Not at all. Not at all. I am give you a line. I am give you a quote. Then you will be realize that it yes. Someone has beautifully quoted Marth ko kabhi dard nahi hota. I hope you guys hear this quotation many of a time. This is so sad. This is the harsh reality of the society. Uh, why? Are you not human? Sir, are you not human? Don't have any emotions? Then why? You know why guys? Because of us only. We together form the society and in this society we believe that men don't have emotion, men not cry, men cannot be fragile. And I don't know why guys. And if a single man comes up and dare to be little bit fragile and can cry and so of his fears, then millions of mouths are always ready to say that he's weak, they are weak, he's loser, he's failure and he's just like a woman. What is his behavior? And uh, I just want to tell you one thing guys. When we talk about the constitution, when we talk about the legal issue, uh, this line is very important. If a man give a commitment to a girl and he fails to fulfill it, then he could be then he could be sent into a jail, into a rape case. But there would not have a single constitutional law made for women that she fails to fulfill their commitment. There could be certain action would be taken on it, not at all. And uh, there are certain incidents uh, in a society which are very unfortunate things happening. That uh, maturity of death cases, suicidal rate and death due to heart attacks of the men are due to the reason that they are the victim of untold story, unspoken word and unheard feelings and lots of family pressure, marriage pressure, child pressure, economic pressure and uh, so many things. The burden lies on him like this and still we are ignoring and still we are uh, thinking that men would be received always. Why? And uh, I want I and uh, I want I and uh, I want to tell you one thing guys uh, that not all men are wrong and not all women are right. Uh, this is the fact guys, believe me or not, but this is the fact. And I am not here to disgrace women, that's why I didn't speak anything against women. I am here just to tell about what what a man actually meant for, how he is looked up as a responsibility wearing in a society. And uh, some of time you can imagine a life of women who is not working but is still still live a good life with their family, with their children, like our mothers. But we cannot imagine a life of men without being a job, without being a worker. 